I've heard multiple times bank executives right. tell me, you know, the new generation is coming in and they're asking us, what are you doing to give back? Mm -hmm. And as much as, again, I think we all agree at strategic level, open source is not charity, it certainly is a way of giving back. So it's kind of this interesting. I, I think there's a, I mean, I think there's a more fundamental commercial. I mean, if I, if I, if I, if I, as a bank or a, you know, if I'm responsible for making all, doing all of the development of a proprietary custom you know, yeah. solution, it's all on me. That's a massive investment. Yeah. And and then I've got to worry about interoperability and working with my counterparties yes. and does it work? Or if I, or if you rally a community of five or eight banks to basically say, look, we're all going to contribute. Yeah. I can cut my, you know, you can cut your investment into it down to an eighth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can you can increase the the utility of it because it's been done as a group and you know it's going to work with your counterparties. Yeah. Like I, I put it on very commercial terms of yeah. you know it's the antithesis of charity. It's 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 <laughs> it is you know it is you know prudent investment governance. That's yeah, the, yeah, that's great. I also that's feel great. like I need to say, I, so it's not surprising to me that the financial sector and regulators are, I don't, I wouldn't say late to the game, but like the, the latest no. adopters, right? Um, it is critical that our financial systems move slowly, a little more slowly than perhaps technology yep. is yep. innovating, right? Um, they're, they're the backbone of our economies. When they fail or something goes wrong, um, there's dramatic impact on individuals. People lose homes, people lose savings, right? So I think it, it's actually quite prudent to watch and then step in when you start to see, okay, we've had X systemic problems. Perhaps now I'm seeing through experimentation yeah. and other um, uh, organizations being able to be early adopters that this outcome, open source results in these outcomes, and that could potentially solve our problems. Let's go forward and explore that. I, I think, so sometimes I, we get very excited, right? We're all in innovation work. So we're constantly like, what's next? How do we iterate? What do we improve on? Um, what haven't we discovered yet? I, I take comfort, particularly with our central banks, um, but certainly our commercial banks as well, that they aren't the first ones out of the gate yeah. uh, adopting some of these new um, these new technologies or ways of working. Um, so I just want, I, I don't know, I wanted to put that out there That's that, a um, yeah. you know, why is the financial services uh, sector behind? I, I don't think they're behind. I think they're taking the weight of their remit um, in a very serious way, and this is how it shows up.